All right, guys. Say hi to Ashley. Hello. Can you tell YouTube and Facebook and Instagram or wherever this is going who you are? I'm Ashley McGilley. I'm a licensed realtor with EXD. Come through. That's the first time I've heard that. Come through. Okay. And how do you know Amina? She was my teacher earlier. Um, yeah, I'm going to start to study. Relax. Ashley's trying to get used to being on video, which clearly you guys don't see me, so I, obviously I'm not yet, but uh, so how do you know me? So, so Amina was my <laughs> teacher in high school and I graduated, she left, and I found out that she was a realtor and I was like, whoa, really? That's what I want to get into. So we connected and I got my license, I passed, and here we are, I'm under her, she's my sponsor and my mentor. Yay! So exciting. That's what you're supposed to do. Okay, that's awesome. Yeah, so anyway, so what are we doing today? Today we're going through our final walkthrough before closing. And what are we gonna do for my clients? Oh, we're gonna bring some uh, welcome balloons and set up a little card because they're out of state, so they've never been here before, and we'll make them feel very welcome to yes. Florida and Tampa. Yes, awesome. All right, guys. So we're we're looking for what kind of flowers we want to grab them. I think we're leaning towards this orange one because it's pretty big. You guys probably hear my mass voice. What do you think? I'm bringing, I'm going with the presents. The orange brings more brightness. Yeah. I like this one. I like that one. It's more yellow. It's more of a blooming. Yeah. All right. The let's are blooming. Boom. Now we're going to get some balloons. All right. So I'm trying to figure out which balloon to get. And I think I'm going to get the, the thank you one, maybe. <laughs> I have any like congrats. They don't have any like congrats, right? Yeah. I mean, they have machine smiles and stuff. It's so trash. Maybe good luck. Maybe 24. I did like those balloons before. They cost a lot though. The numbers. Yep. I think I'm gonna get this thank you. Where is, I saw thank you somewhere. Right here. And it matches. Look at that coordination. Look at the combo. <laughs> Mina does for her clients. It's above and beyond. We are at the title company for yes. closing. Exactly. So it's real. Every title company is different. What did you learn about title companies today? Who chooses it? Oh, the seller chooses it. Yeah. Do they have to? No, but it's. In most cases, they do. Okay, at least in, in, in our area, yeah? In our area. But, but, so this is where we're gonna go, close on the home. What did you learn about closing? Like, when does the closing actually take place? After the final walkthrough, once everything looks good, if there's no other things that need to be fixed. And when they sign the paperwork, is it over? If all the funds are here. Yes. Okay, yes. Awesome, boom. So what happens if you sign the paperwork and the funds aren't here? Can you give the keys? No. Why not? They're not officially title or homeowners. It's not exactly. Officially it's not closed. Yeah. So, not ready? Are you ready to see what this is like? Okay. Yay! Yay! Hey. You're welcome. So, what would you? What advice would you give someone that is relocating to another state? Call Amina. Uh, go to that place before you come out there, or go there. Okay. Do your research. Okay. Do your research. Call Amina. <laughs> do more looking, and then call Amina. Thank you so much. All right. Why? Why would you tell people to call Amina? We had a really bad experience at the beginning of the year, and we started in June with Amina, and here we are, in August. Yay. What would you say um, the best part of the process was? Everything was was spot on, what we needed. So, timing oh. and communication. What would you say the worst part of the process was? There was no worst. Yeah, there was no worst yeah. part. No worst part with Amina? No. What, what about before Amina was the worst part? Stress. Uh, this is probably the less stress I've been over a lot of things. Awesome. Why would you say working with Amina was a good decision? Or, or what did you like about working with Amina? For me, if the realtor can make it easy, then that's the best part of it. If I have to continue, if I'm doing more work than the realtor, then why did I hire the realtor? So how did Amina make it easy? She did her job. <laughs> she did her job. She did it 10 times more, even when we weren't thinking about it. 
she was 10 times ahead of us. Oh, we need to do this, make sure that we did it and we kept up with it. Awesome. And is there any advice that you'd like to give for uh, future first time home buyers? I know you guys have bought a few homes at this point. Just research. Research know what you want before you go out there and try to buy it. And make sure that you are ready for the process. Financially as well. Yes. You don't have any money, you won't be able to get it if you want. So. <laughs> awesome. Braylon, do you want to say anything? Do you love your house? What do you like about the house? I like my room. I like the stage and I like all the part of the house. Love it, thank you. Awesome, Riley, do you like the house? Yeah. <laughs> She's, She's home by me. Yay! So, are you excited for your own closing days? Yes. What do you think about trying to make closing days special for your clients? I think that's gonna be one of my favorite, <laughs> I think that's gonna be one of my favorite parts of this whole thing other than just you know like actually s signing and getting the home and figure, <laughs> fi finding that one once we choose the one coming to closing day and making it feel special for them letting them know that this is finally it the process is over i'm really excited for that yeah i think i'm gonna do really good at that part <laughs> okay awesome would you say it's really beneficial to ride along and like shadow real estate oh my gosh like i think that if you are definitely getting into real estate you need to find a mentor or find just an agent who has the time to let you shadow and come along for their adventures. <laughs> Even if you're not, you know, able to participate because it's their deal, just being there and listening was more helpful than you could think. Yay! So, so far I know you've only been at ESP like a few days. <laughs> what do you think so far? Honestly, I would recommend it to like, it's only been a few days and I don't even have anything to say that I've done there, but I would recommend <laughs> it to anybody because not even just from you, but even being like in EXP world and workplace, I've already had people reach out to me if I have any questions. They're also in Florida and Tampa, stuff like that. So there's so many people around that are available to help. And with my few other interviews with other people, I couldn't imagine it have being like that. Yeah. <laughs> like, not